Yeah. You've been working out, Pop-Pop? <laughs> Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I got those uh, muscular dad thighs. Hey y'all. <laughs> um, continue. Don't play with me. Why does it keep going to this other screen, girl? All right, we're in. Also, no back seating, please, because this is well. This is Rex's first time playing it. This is like my second time, and y'all know I don't remember anything. So you know, just chill, enjoy the vibes. No back seating, okay? Unless we ask. But even then, like, we can ask each other. Like, we, we, we figured it out. Watching us struggle, yeah. just the two of us. Just watch us struggle. Is part of the fun. It's you know? part of, of the experience. Your fun is watching us struggle. <laughs> okay, um, ready? Yes. Where they have sown the wind, shall reap the whirlwind. Every choice has a consequence. Decision saves lives. Others lead to death. That poor rat. I need to finish up. Thanks, Taylor. The wheel is 264. We're in Chicago, y'all. Look. Yay, yay, yay. Whatever pleases you the most. You please me the most. You mean you are not weary of me Aww. after an entire day of marriage? I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. <laughs> Make oil. Tincture? Right. <laughs> Make oil ointment. Oh, ointment. Is this the murder house? This is about the murder house, isn't it? Isn't this great? We can, uh, we can kind of put some pieces together. Let's check in. <laughs> Wonder if anybody's built this in The Sims. Ooh. Find out. We actually got to build it. Are we the only ones here? I'm sure that was a mad dash first thing this morning to get to the fair. This one's crazy. You're going to be hollering. I'm excited. It's, it's really ugly. Ooh! What a handsome bloke! The fair will show us all sorts of wonderful things to come. Stay but the only me. future I care about is ours. Oh, Jeff! Oh, Talk like that shucks. makes me wish there was a way I could marry you twice. Let's have babies now. Oh, we about to get it in. I wish they'd hurry up so we can finally be alone in our room. Oh, do you now? Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. That's my Marie. Always finding that silver lining. Oh! My sincere oh. apologies. For both startling you and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. I promise right? from here on out it will be nothing but silver linings. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Please sign in here. First time in Chicago. First time in Chicago. In Chicago. Sure, I'm not sure. Hazard a guess and assume you're they already, taking the exposition. They already cut off. The fair, yes, but that's not all. Today is a very special day for us. I'm wedded. Oh, a honeymoon. How very, very lovely. I say it like that. Yes, today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. In that case, an upgrade is in order. The honeymoon suite it is. Oh, well, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> it's not gonna be. Right, is it, are you getting charged? I think nothing right. of it. The same rates as your regular room. Dude. The upgrade is on us. H.H. H. Holmes, he was You're a swindler. He was a con artist. Room. He was a terrible person. <laughs> How kind. 
Thank you, Mr. Is that just my screen that's doing Holmes. that weird thing? Henry Howard Holmes. Henry Howard. You have a lovely hotel, Mr. Henry Holmes. Oh, well, thank you very much. Um, there we go. I Henry! built most of it myself. <laughs> You're an architect, then? Architect. Designer. Builder. Con man. Swindler. Doctor, yeah. Artist. Yeah. I'm a Ma name it all. Many interests. <laughs> Impressive. Mm -hmm. Please have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at yeah. the pharmacy. If y'all haven't I'll listened take to a documentary about H.H. Sure Holmes, you should, because this man was crazy. Just make a note if you Just decide to purchase shit. anything, and we will add it to Do your you know bill. That, um, did, did you know that uh, incubators that they keep creamy infants in uh, first debuted at the Chicago World Fair. I um, didn't know that. It was that. like a, like, like, and the guy who invented them couldn't get doctors to take them seriously. And so, like, for dire cases of, like, really, babies that came too early or, like, had issues, you know, like, they would be like, you need to go to the World Fair. And, like, Whoa. to... It's why, because it was like, it was like a sideshow, like, come see these tiny little infants Whoa. because, like, you know, isn't that weird? Isn't that, that is weird? crazy, yeah. Ugh. Anyway. Another, like, freak show, sideshow type thing. So, like, you know, while this is going on, there's also probably, like, a sideshow at the World's Fair I'm of sure. babies. I'm sure. <laughs> That's weird. crazy. I would be alive during this. Well, I wouldn't be there. I'm, <clears throat> I'm black. <laughs> And I'm trying to probably, I probably wouldn't be there. I would have a sweet spot at like the Western days, you know? Mm. Like that would be my if I was gonna time travel to the past, if I had to go back, I would want to aim for the Western. Mm -hmm. That's fair. Pardon me, miss. Careful you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. That sounds like, like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? They're so lame. Lovely. Thanks, bro. <laughs> right? Everyone well, let's just head out. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know? Oh, I like the ring. Yeah, they're pretty. These probably all came from people that he killed. Mm -hmm. You're onto something, Rex. Where'd he get all these? Wonder what's in here. One sweet death. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. <laughs> oh, why he opened it? Nothing but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait. What's that? <gasps> Don't move. Oh shit, okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Rex, here we go. Oh no. Oh no! Oh shit! Honey. I'm panicking. <laughs> Swear. Marie. <laughs> shit, Maria. I can't remember. It's Marie, honey. Okay, all right. I was that right. was a thrill. You won't think it's thrilling if we're sleeping on the street after getting kicked out of here. I guess getting. Kicked Boy, out relax. Out They're gonna get so murdered. Yeah, getting kicked out would be the best case scenario, actually. Right, right. Like, let's leave. He looks very dapper. He does. Like, the hat is a killer, okay? Swag. Welcome, Ooh. newly <laughs> to the honeymoon suite. Look how pretty. <laughs> uh, We're gonna do it on the chair. Mr. Holmes. <laughs> do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I, I have 
everywhere. work to return to. I got limbs to saw I'm off. Sure. I got blood to extract. Excuse me for a second. <laughs> Suspicious manner of speaking. Oh, look Goodness, at this place is fit for a king. This is so pretty. Hi, Key. This or is really my pretty. queen. Oh, you. Kiss this. Oh. That uh, is not very uh, wifely of you. They're so cute. Oh, look at them. Don't smack oh, me, shit. honey. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my gosh. Oh. Honey, how dare you? Thought you had me, sweetie. Yeah. Take that. Victory. Yeah. <laughs> you cheated. Let's do it. Close your eyes. And face the mirror. Aren't you clever and romantic? If I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. Oh. <laughs> Is there a problem? No. Open your eyes. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. Victory is mine. Man. I'll let you have that bath now. That vest. Something about a good vest. Ooh. Ooh. It's jammed shut. Maybe if we put a little weight into it? Ew, and why? <coughs> Open sesame! Period. <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that I word. like the little five o'clock. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. Shave. I think I forgot to pack my razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that I bath. I, I didn't forget. Don't I you shaved. worry. Uh. Settle into hotel. Find a shave. Find a shaving kit. Time for a bath. <laughs> Rub it sad. I go into these rooms. Was there somebody in is that a hat? Yo, there was somebody. Y'all saw that? I don't know. Sorry. What? What the hell is even that? Oh, I love a good Victorian tub. This is like <laughs> goals. Honestly, I love a big ass tub. Clawfoot. Mm hmm. Clawfoot. Why is she still wearing her jewelry? Can I take that off? Oh! Uh oh, Rex. Is that you, Dad? They don't sound good. <gasps> Jeff? Oh, are we playing another okay. game? Well, they're telling me how to run. Um, I don't know what I should I can't do. Remember I'm just gonna. I'm, I'm gonna be a white girl. I'm just gonna relax. I can't remember <laughs> where the room is. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done that because my man looks like he's in danger. But you know, she cool. We vibing. Already? Wait, wait, what, what was our room number? None of these you know, doors have numbers. Is awfully Where big. did I come from? Where did I go? Where the I hell? I think there might be room for another body. Where's my, I, I have a button for oh. this. Mm, that's nice. Ow. You don't know your own uh, strength. Easy, dear. Jeff, that hurts. Hello, my dear. Oh, I know. I lost all hope today. I'm dead. I think I'm wrong. I think I'm wrong. Already? There we are. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Rex, are you okay? Because I'm not okay. Yeah, I almost fell in a pit of spikes, though. Oh, you're going to be really upset at me. <laughs> in the pit of spikes? I was, gonna, I was trying to warn you about the pit of spikes, but I couldn't figure out how to get back Ooh, to the room. Baby, I'm still in the tub. 
Oh. <laughs> I'm in that tub. What are you doing? If you've touched Maria... You're a bit late with that sentiment, good sir. <laughs> Hit him, Rex! Kill him! Is there a problem, sir? <gasps> kill him, Rex! Rex, kill him! Yeah, yeah, in the eye, in the eye! Yes! Now close the door. Okay. Please, God, no. Oh! Don't fight. Damn! It's already done. Crazy. Is that fast? More this. Oh! Here we go. Won't you spare me over till another year? <laughs> oh my god, my dog. Oh, he looks so, he's worried. Kinda. He looks so good. He does. He's back. A feather. A feather. Oh. You're here. He Have you been stressed? waiting long? Welcome back. I do enjoy <laughs> seeing a familiar face. I'm hot now. <laughs> Good to see Last you too. Yeah, we miss you. We miss you, there, right? <laughs> the last you time no one tried. Ooh. Is that what he said? Yeah, he said last time no one survived. I wonder it's if you so were even good trying. to have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience them? This is a story about those who create, and the lengths they might go to for their art to be made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions. Delight, inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. Mm -hmm. The way you react, the decisions you make, will affect this story. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. Oh! They give glimpses oh, they of the possible consequences of your choices. And sometimes it's the mm. smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions repercussions that you will all experience. So if I could handle anything I better can't than medium, interfere. honestly? That's very much against the rules. He looks great. I can only observe what great. happens and record any significant events. Oh. Ever seen one of these? They're very old. People used to call them obols. They put them ah. in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Yes. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest places. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find, and I'll certainly make it worth your while. It's time in. Mm-hmm. Well, shall we start? Yes! The game is afoot. I will be watching. Let's go, Rex. Let's go. He tired. He was tired, yeah, if I, if right? I had Daddy cure it. He's tired of us, probably. probably. He said, like, you, were you even trying? No one survived last time. My name is Kate Walker. Uh, H.H. Holmes. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. Hey, I'm Mark. I study photography at <laughs> UCLA. Um, had a great time. Really want to get back into some serious photography. I've done a key grip and lighting test for years. Look, it's Fliss Here's reincarnated. Light it. It's cute from the side. Sorry, but... do you start with qualifications or um like personal info? Because I don't. I mean, will anyone access this? 
I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonnett, UK originally. I've uh, been here for 20 years. The last series was so on track. Another salt was, pepper daddy uh, Rex. <laughs> it was a very beautifully conceived and um, didn't quite uh, uh, hit the mark as I was hoping it would. It's a fucking mess, to be honest with you. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. He said the title! He said it! On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, until finally the monster was dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders, but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city. The number grew significantly, nearly 200 lives. Crazy. America's first serial killer and possibly the worst. He was buried as requested under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? Dun, dun, dun. So, dun, 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 dun. What do you think? He's poor babies. To be honest, Charlie, this is a pile of... Yeah, why is her hairline back here, bro? They could have put it like four inches in the front and she would have been fine. Charles Lonnett, please. Speaking, Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll she send a call for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and mm -hmm. frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, this conversation <laughs> is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Dang. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes, of course, we're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. Here we go. Road trip. Huzzah. Woohoo. Hooray. <laughs> this is going to be great, guys. So do we know where we're going exactly? Mm. You don't like surprises? You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say it. Topeka? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket. A dead phone and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault. That sounds terrible. You fly by the seat of your ass. That does sound horrible. So, come on, Charlie. What do we oh, know God. about this guy? And you're he's traveling with him again? He's a recluse. He's obsessed with H.H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We got ah! property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Mm. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder castle. Whoa. Dumet has blueprints, documents. Oh, artifacts. cool. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. This is crazy. And you substantiated all of this. Just trust me. Yeah, Kate, I think. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. No. While this may sound strange, no, not I no. You to film the collection inside my home. I cannot allow any personal devices that was may this share information part of the plan? that can affect my this? business or lifestyle. There no. are rules. No, no, no. All footage Did we know about this? must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. No. I must insist. His place, his rules. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. Could be making us pay, but he isn't. If this is all he asks, then we do it. Fine. 
For the show. For the show! I'm telling you, this is gonna be great. You said that in Topeka. Everyone's like, um, we hate you. <coughs> <laughs> yeah, he's like, did, did we know about this? <laughs> did you sign us all up for <laughs> did this? You know? Did you know about that? <laughs> because I wouldn't have agreed to that. Right. <laughs> That's what I would have been saying too. Mm -hmm. Do we know about this? <laughs> Did everyone know about this? <laughs> Is this due to service? We Shouldn't we have service or something? Also true. Is guy gonna help? <clears throat> no. Really? I got it. Thanks, bro. Don't sweat it. The real questions. That's me. Why is that me in my Ubers? <laughs> that is so me. Okay, no, Rex really, is I got it. Okay. Who am I? So now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the sky. I think you're the hot salt Not and pepper daddy. The mist and fog. There, from on high, we'll get a better look. Can we not? That's certainly um, up there. The, the visuals will be great, and we can frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. Mark, this is crazy. I love him! We'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice yeah, knowing you. Dog. Come on. Okay, so Rex is Charlie. This is so fitting. Rex is the grandpa. Yeah. I am... What's my name? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> funny, funny. Sorry, Chief. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, sport. Champ. Approach I'm, a, wall I'm spry. Sense. I'm spry for an old guy. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Smoking 10 packs a day. <clears throat> <clears throat> wow, this is us in real life. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. Whoa. This is really pretty, though. Look at this. Wow. 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 Is there a photo mode? Thank God, no. <laughs> what do you mean, thank God? Ooh. Jesus, what do you, what do you mean? It's meant to be heard from miles away. That scared well, yeah, me. I know that in theory, but... I'm gonna start calling you Pop-Pop. Jamie and Kate okay. would never have agreed to come if you hadn't been on board. I figured that the episode was such a mess, we needed all the help we could get. Right. The yeah. artists. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. I guess we do. There's nothing what in this corner. What do you for their art? That's right. Yo, you good, pop up? Yep. <laughs> All right. <laughs> good job, pop up. All right, here we go. Surprise. There you go. All right, got the leg span. Yeah. You been working out, pop up? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I got those uh, muscular dad thighs. <laughs> the little gray hair on there. <laughs> Muscular right. dad thighs. Alright, I need some strong arms for this. Oh, it fixes oh. itself good. Or we can just do that. Oh. Okay, I need a light. Hey, Whoa, pop pop. Wrap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off. Go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that concerning eye of yours, you know. I got a lot going on at the moment, Charlie. Oh, this feels like a weird time right, to have yeah, this conversation. Sure. It, uh, absolutely, Rex. I agree. You head together. I appreciate it. I'll be fine in post on that. Come on, Pop-Pop. You should do the same. Take some time out. You got I don't know how to go leave. Oh, well. No, Mrs. Lonnet, you got hiding in some closet somewhere? Married to the job. Married to the job. Oh, he's lonely. Pop-Pop. How's that marriage working out? Well, from what I hear about real marriages, Pretty damn good. <laughs> <laughs> Married to the job. What a weird time to have this conversation. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go, Rex. Like, why would you have to ask for time off while you're like shimmying across a ledge? All right, pop pop. Don't let me fall, pop pop. Okay, okay. Ooh, I did it, pop pop. All right, you're okay. third. You're third. There you go. Look at that. Yeah, okay. spring chicken. 
That's right. You guys wish your granddad was this strong. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Going through. Please don't let right, them pop in. out. Go on, champ. Please, please, please! I knew it. <laughs> I, knew it. Oh, I felt shit. the build up. They didn't. What the hell was that thing? <sighs> Gotta do better what than that, guys. No! 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 What happened? <laughs> 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 oh, that's so good. I knew it was coming, and it still didn't save me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pop Pop. We love you. Go <laughs> on up there now. Watch your hip. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. Oh, we made it. Look. Yay, yay. And zoom into that lighthouse. Ooh. Look, it's all right. Oh, thank God. We better get back. Get back. Oh, good. Yeah, they didn't make us climb back down our Right. Just had the one <laughs> How did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I couldn't ask. Stupid. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? Also, there's Drake. Hello, Mr. Lonnet. Look at him. That's me. I'm Grantham Dumet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin. Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Sure. Of course. It's the devil. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> the cement wasn't enough. Mm-mm. We have no idea what's in store for us.